the story opens with Utterson and Enfield on a walk one Sunday night. Enfield sees a door and relates when he saw a strange man named Hyde trample a little girl. During the rising action, Enfield grabbed the man and with a few others, blackmailed the man. The man took them to the door where he went inside and retrieved the blackmail money. As a lawyer, Utterson has the will to Dr. Jekyll, who has oddly left everything to Mr. Hyde. Utterson visits Jekyll's friend and science partner, Dr. Lanyon, who reveals that he and Jekyll are no longer talking due to a scientific disagreement. Utterson sets out to find Hyde, waits by the door, and eventually introduces himself. Hyde is repulsive and gives Utterson a nasty and hostile greeting. Two weeks later, when he dines with Jekyll, Utterson asks about Hyde. Jekyll tells Utterson not to bring him up anymore, but makes Utterson promise to give Hyde his rights if Jekyll disappears. One year later, Hyde beats a respected gentleman to death. After the police find a letter on the body addressed to Utterson, they contact him. He takes the police to Hyde's residence, which shows signs of a hasty escape. Utterson visits Jekyll to ask if he's heard about the murder and if he is hiding Hyde. Jekyll assures Utterson he is not and hands him a letter from Hyde claiming that he has fled and that Jekyll need not worry about him anymore. Utterson takes the letter and asks his friend, who is a clerk, an expert in handwriting, to compare it to one of Jekyll's letters. He reveals that Jekyll forged the letter. Two months pass in which Jekyll seems to have returned to normal, but then suddenly he shuts Utterson out. Utterson visits Lanyon again, who is deathly ill as if from a great shock. He asks Lanyon what happened, but he won't say. Utterson writes Jekyll, asking what happened. Jekyll replies he and Lanyon are no longer friends. A few weeks later, Lanyon dies. Sometime after that, Utterson and Enfield go for a walk and speak with Jekyll through his window. Suddenly, Jekyll looks frightened and slams the window shut. In the climax, one evening sometime later, Poole visits Utterson to tell him something is wrong with his master, Jekyll. They go back to Jekyll's house and Utterson and Poole break down his door. During the falling action, they find Mr. Hyde dying after drinking poison. During the resolution, the only thing they find is an envelope addressed to Utterson that contains three enclosures. The first is the revised will, which leaves everything to Utterson. The second is a note to read Lanyon's letter that Utterson has at home. The third is Jekyll's confession. Reading Lanyon's letter, it is revealed that the shock that killed him was seeing Hyde turn into Jekyll. Reading Jekyll's explanation, it is revealed that in his research, he discovered a way to split the two sides of humans, good and evil. He used a potion to do just that, thus creating Mr. Hyde. Eventually, he couldn't control Hyde anymore, and that's why he kills both of them through suicide.